Hello! In today's video I will be doing a very bronzy, glowy makeup look with new products that I have. So yeah, let's get started! And first of all I wanted to show you a dupe that I found. So uh, I have this famous professional that we all know. Uh, it is 7.5 mils and I got this primer. Um, it, it is called Air Fit Pore Primer. It is exactly the same. It's even like the color is the same. So it's pink and the professional is pink too because this is the one like luminizing one I think they are like the same thing and professional is more like glowier but they are the exact same thing and the price actually is the same so uh, here we have 35 mils and here are 7.5 mils and they have the same price so I think this is much more cost efficient so I will be putting this on and all the links uh, to the products will be down below I'm taking not too much, I think it might be too much but it works magic it really blurs the skin and fills the pores because I have this primer for a long time and I didn't want to repurchase it because it's so expensive so I got this one and it's very nice I think so moving on um, what we got I think we'll start with the uh, eyeshadow primer also. I have this Added House uh, primer. It's very similar to Urban Decay one and it's way cheaper than that. It holds the eyeshadow pretty good and it also makes it more vibrant. So I really like uh, I really like it because those primers are so pricey that I don't want to spend this money on it and you actually get a lot I think 10 mils is in here so it's pretty nice deal and it was like five dollars so while it's drying um, Let's do a concealer. So I have this zoom in concealer from um, Black Rouge. So what is this concealer? Uh, it's really nice, but it's a little bit light. So I will put it under my foundation. So this concealer uh, is called zoom in because it is supposed to like uh, smooth the skin and make it like filtered skin. And when you zoom in, if you look close, uh, you will not see anything. So let's see. I tried it a few times, but it's, as I said, too light for me. As brightening, it's great, I think. But it's a little too light, so I just put it under foundation and it's great. And now I think we can do brows maybe. So for the first time in my life I got brow product. Uh, it's Keep My Brows Fixed uh, gel from Edit House. And I'm not sure, should I do brows right now? I think I need to wait because I like need to blend 
all the products and by the way this is my sponge and i will show you it comes with this coffee cup and it's super soft because if you go back uh, i think not on my youtube videos or i don't remember maybe uh, i had ysl sponge and it was so like um i don't know the word dense that uh, you have to like uh, force it to squish it was very hard but this one is super soft i didn't wet it because i'm not sure if you are supposed to wet it or not so i will try it like this and i'm not trying to blend the concealer very much because i'll put foundation on top I just want to cover some spots that I have under the eyes it's pretty nice it's covered pretty well and I think it's really good but I look like Casper Bronzy look? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> this is your bronzy look. Well, I'm pale as my walls. This sponge is pretty nice, very soft. It covered everything pretty nicely, but I still have this red spot that I'm... Oh my god. The spring comes and the allergies come and it's kind of hard. Mm. I want to try pony effect technique um, to cover with like uh, that concealer, I don't know how it's called, like um, cream one that I have. So I will try it later probably. Okay, it covered everything pretty nicely. So now um, we'll move on to foundation probably. So I will show you my favorite foundation like ever. It's New Roman Collection. It is so, so amazing. And first of all, the packaging is stunning. It's glowy foundation and this is it so I will show you right now it has pretty good coverage but it's not heavy and it's still like healthy glowy natural skin and I have a few powders but First of all, it's glowy look today, and also I don't really like powders because they make my feel my feel what my face very dry. And the video I did, um, I will link it here. It was like um, Instagram makeup uh, versus uh, real life makeup, and I made like the bacon under my eyes. I couldn't recover my eyes for a week probably it was so dry and I put a lot of skincare on it and <laughs> nothing worked and uh, then I got my snail cream I think and it helped that was like a mess so I'm not using any powders especially under my eyes no thank you ma'am so this is the foundation and right now we'll probably move on to the bronzer because we have bronzy look today this is from vd cosmetics the bronzing stick it's quite dark in the package but it's nice i tried it already so let's um yeah it will be bronzy kind of a little 
one bit of orange. So let's blend it out <laughs> because I look scary. Mm, okay. It blends easily and it's not orange. I'm looking more alive right now. So now an exciting part, liquid blushes. They are super popular right now. And I have this uh, Mimi box. Uh, well, it's uh, I'm Mimi a balm. It is a multitasking balm, so it's for cheeks and lips. And I haven't used it on my cheeks yet. I have uh, three more colors. And yeah, I will link here the video that I did about them. So let's try and they are super pigmented, so I'm kind of scared. I will put a little bit on my hand. And let's try it. It is browny shade. I have also a reddish one pinky one and orangey one. Oh wow. Oops. It might not show as bright on camera because I have two soft boxes. Mm. I like it. Uh, I have two pimples and you can see them a little bit. Um, I think I can put a little bit more. So it, it blends out pretty well. It might look a little weird because I don't have any other makeup on. But it will come together. But first let's do eyes. I got this liquid shadow uh, and it's so amazing. I like it that's... Blah. I like it because it's so easy to use, but I think you can't get it right now because it's out of stock, but I saw Colourpop has similar shadows. I actually, for the first time in my life, bought Colourpop stuff. It's still on the way, but I hope it will be all good. Um, I never ordered from Colourpop because I have to pay um, like the import fee, I think it's called. Basically, I need to pay tax for it. But I was like, anyways, I want to order. They had like 25% of everything sale So I was like give me everything, you know, I got their super shock shadow set I got Their um, lip liner set I got a uh, Wild Child Shadow Palette and their Shock Shadows. So, and I don't remember uh, what else did I get, but I got the I got a lot of stuff. So yeah. So 
So this is the eyes and we of course will add some sparkle. I have this Holika Holika palette that was free when I um, got my YesStyle order. So this is the palette, it's huge actually. Uh, so, and those like glitter shades, they are so pretty. I will take this shade and I will take um, this shade. Let's try to the finger. Yes, wow, wow, what? I didn't expect this at all. I thought it's like a little bit like, I don't know, like separate glitter. Oh my god, it's so like foiled. I don't think I own anything like this. Wow. Liner. This is my favorite liner. Now let's move on to mascara. I have one Eclab mascara. It has tiny, tiny wand. So I added some mascara. I think it looks alright. I haven't done my makeup in a long time and this is my first time in a long time doing my makeup so yeah I think it's pretty okay. Um, let's move on to brows. So this is my first brow product. It's a brow fixer from Edit House. It was also very affordable and let's see I'm not sure what I'm trying to do here some like messy brows let's see and I feel like those brows look stupid Anyways, let's move on to the concealer, concealer brush and take a concealer. My neighbors are just going crazy, as always. That's it. And this is cream concealer from VT Cosmetics. I have also foundation, like stick foundation, but I haven't tried it yet, so I will like try it in future videos. So let's do highlighter. I have this jelly highlighter from Holika Holika. It's so amazing. I will take a little bit. It's blinding actually and i can show you here it's like wow so we need a tiny bit if i'm not really blending it out it's like what is this i took too much probably Let's move on to the lips, last step, and I have this pen um, in Smoky Amber from uh, I'm Mimi. It's a matte lipstick. It's very soft and you can't even tell that I'm wearing lipstick. It's like... It's not drying whatsoever. It doesn't dry to that crusty, you know, usually liquid lipstick thing. 
and so soft so that's the video and hope you enjoyed it maybe it was a little bit boring but i really wanted to try some makeup that i have and i wanted to do some makeup because i haven't done it in a long time subscribe like and follow me on instagram all the products will be linked below and use my code if you shop on yes style i got all the products from there bye